Fire officials in Lawrence are out with a stark warning. They say someone will die if illegal apartments continue to exist in the city. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Lisa Hughes. Several illegal units were found in weekend fires. A firefighter was injured and a resident was trapped at one scene. WBZ's Tammy Mutasa is live in Lawrence with more of the fire chief's message to the community tonight. Tammy. Lisa, tonight the chief says they are seeing more and more of these illegal apartments during fires, including one just behind me. And he's worried about people, safety, as well as firefighters who are responding to these dangerous situations. But, you know, neighbors say that the city needs to do more because rent prices are going up, forcing people to live in these situations. Big flames shooting through a home left two firefighters hurt and a neighbor trapped on Salem Street. Here's a situation where we could have not only lost a civilian, but we could have lost two firefighters. Several 911 phone calls for a fire. A few weeks later, another inferno at a home on Bodwell Street displaced 11 people. Neighbor Samuel saw that fire. I've never seen a fire like that, not even close to my house. It turns out the fires broke out at homes with illegal apartments inside. What we're interested in is making sure where you live is safe. And we have a problem with that. On Bodwell Street, firefighters say they discovered the questionable apartments in an attic and a basement where the fire actually started. On Salem Street, they found two more illegal apartments. A lot of times these illegal apartments only have one exit, which is... Uh, very dangerous for us. The Lawrence Fire Chief says it's happening more often as rent prices are spiking in the region. We're not trying to push people into the sidewalk. We're not trying to get them out in the cold. There's a difference between whether they've done it right and followed the rules and being safe or right and follow the rules and it's unsafe. But first responders warn it's very dangerous not going through the proper inspection process with fire and building inspectors or not having safety equipment. We want to have smoke and CO detectors installed on the house. We don't want exposed electrical wires in the house. And with 85% of Lawrence residents living in rented homes, city leaders have vowed to address the issues. Samuel hopes it's soon. He's been looking for a safe and affordable apartment for three months. The rent is really expensive and the house is too. Um, I guess if it's happening, it's because people's trying to find a cheaper place to live. And the chief says if you're living in an apartment and you're worried that it is not safe, but you don't want to say anything to your landlord, you can feel free to reach out to the fire department to start that inspection process. Again, the goal is not to get people in trouble, but to make those units safer for everybody. Live in Lawrence, Tammy Matassa, WBZ News. All right, Tammy, thank you.